Problem 9-2. Calculate the hydronium and hydroxide ion concentration and the pH and pOH of 0.2 molar AQ solution of sodium hydroxide at 25 degrees Celsius. So, the given, you are given the concentration of sodium hydroxide at 25 degrees Celsius and that is 0.2 molar. And we are required to determine, take note, this is an AQ solution, so of course this one is uh, dissolved in water. So we are going to determine the concentration of the hydronium ion from the dissociation of water and the concentration of the OH ion and the pH and the pOH. Okay. Now as we know, if sodium hydroxide will be ionized since this is a strong base, so it will be ionized completely into sodium ion and hydroxide ion. So whatever is the concentration of sodium hydroxide initially that is 0.2 molar, so once it will be ionized completely, the concentration of hydroxide ion will be also 0.2 molar. Okay, because it is completely ionized. So at equilibrium, there will be no more sodium hydroxide. All of it is being ionized into sodium ion and hydroxide ion. So if you are going to determine the concentration of sodium ion, that is also the same with uh, point 0.2. Okay, that is, you are going to balance it. This is one mole, one mole, one mole. Okay, now one of the unknown is the concentration of the OH ion than the hydronium ion. So we will solve first with the OH ion. Now take note that sodium hydroxide is being is being dissolved in water. So if you are going to rewrite the the ionization of water, same with problem nine one. So we have here actually ionization of water. You have the hydronium ion. and the uh, OH ion, okay? So two moles for water. So you will notice that there will be two OH. OH coming from sodium hydroxide and OH coming from the ionization of water. So you have to get the total, total concentration of the hydroxide ion from sodium hydroxide and from the water. And we know from problem 9-1 that the concentration of the concentration of hydroxyl ion or hydroxide ion is equal to the concentration of the hydronium ion, which is at 25 degrees Celsius. At 25 degrees Celsius, we have uh, computed that one in problem 9-1, which is equal to 1.0 times 10 to the negative 7 molar. So, we know that the concentration of the hydroxide ion from sodium hydroxide is 0.2, you will add this one. So, that is the total. So, you can have it here as the total hydroxyl ion will be equal to from sodium hydroxide, which is 0.2 molar, plus the concentration of your OH ion from the water, which is the same with the hydroxyl, the same with the hydronium ion. Or you can have it as a plus the concentration of the hydronium ion, which is 1.0 times 10 to the negative 7. Now, since this one is very, very small compared to this one, if you're going to add it, so that would be equal to or approximately that's very very small so this will be approximately same as 0 0.20 molar since that is sodium hydroxide is a strong electrolyte so if you are going to add actually that one that would be just for the sake of computation that is 0 0.200001 Okay, so you're going to add this one that is actually 0 0.2 
times 10 to negative 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, or point 2 times 10 to negative 7. That is 1. So that is, we can have it approximately as 0.2. So this one is negligible. So that is very, very small compared than, compared than uh, 0.2. So therefore, we have the concentration of hydroxyl ion. So we would be able to compute for the pOH. So pOH would be equal to the negative log of the concentration of the hydroxyl ion. So that will be equal to negative log of 0.2 molar. And that is equal to negative log of 0.2. So that is equal to 0.699. So the POH is 0.699. Actually, you can you can compute immediately the pH by subtracting it from 14, or you can have it as you can compute that one based on the concentration of hydrogen, uh, hydronium ion. So therefore, pH would be equal to, would be equal to 14 minus 0.699. So that is 13.301. using the concentration of the hydronium ion. Of course, it has already some amount of sodium hydroxide with a, with a concentration of 0.2. So from the, from the dissociation of water, we have KW also to compute for the concentration of hydronium ion. So that would be equal to the concentration of hydronium ion times the concentration of hydroxyl ion. This is constant, so you would be able to compute for the concentration of hydronium ion. So that is KW over the concentration of hydroxyl ion. So this is what is the constant of uh, ionization constant of water? at 25 degrees Celsius, that is 1.01 times 10 to the negative 14 over the concentration of hydroxyl ion, which is 0.2. So therefore, the concentration of hydronium ion is 1.01 raised to the power of negative 14 divided by 0.2. So that is 5.05 times 10 to the negative 14. So that is molar. So if you are going to compute for the pH, so negative log of 5.05 raised to the power of negative 14, and that is 13.3. So from here, you see this one. Take note of the value of the pH. You have the pOH here. So from here, pH would be equal to the negative log of the concentration of hydronium ion. And that is negative log of the concentration which is 5.05 times 10 to the negative 14. Okay? So using our calculator, then the pH is equal to 13.30. So either to determine the pH, either you can compute it directly 
from here, 14 minus POS, you will arrive 13.3, or you may compute the concentration first, then solve for the pH. Okay? Or from here, or from here, you would be able to determine the concentration of the hydronium ion. For example, so if you already know first the pH, then you are going to solve for the concentration of hydronium ion. Still, you can use the formula pH is equal to the negative log of the concentration of hydronium ion. So this will be our unknown. So concentration of the hydronium ion will be equal to the anti-log of the negative pH. So that will be the anti-log of negative 13.3. And still that is, we will arrive with the same answer. So you will have anti-log of negative 13.3. So you will have 5.01. So, more or less, uh, we differ in this uh, value. So, that's 5.01 5 times 10 to the negative 14. Okay? So, we will differ in, there is an error of 0.05. That is, that is in the rounding of the numbers because we round off here. Okay? So, that is problem. Uh, line 2, did we compute everything? Concentration of hydronium ion. Concentration of the hydronium ion is this one. Or this one. Concentration of the hydroxyl ion is 0.2. pH is, pH is 13.3. And the POH is 0.699. So that is problem 9.